Good afternoon. Today I'd like to present an updated version of the Sharp Trader program, since a lot has changed since the last presentation. The software has been improved and new strategies have been added. This presentation is meant for those who want to understand what the program is for, how it works, and what it can do. It's not about individual strategies. We already have separate videos for each one and we'll include links to them in the description of this video, or you can find them directly on our channel. So, Sharp Trader is a platform designed for trading various instruments such as Forex currencies, metals, indices, and cryptocurrencies across multiple platforms. It's both multi-platform and multi-instrument, so to speak. It is primarily designed for arbitrage trading, but it also supports non-arbitrage strategies. Here I have the strategies window open, but let's start from the sessions window, the first in the menu list. This window allows you to add different sessions, meaning different accounts from various brokers on different platforms. By default, two fast feeds are already added, one in London and one in New York for arbitrage trading, as well as a feed in Tokyo. I've also added a trader account to demonstrate how easily a Fixapi connection can be established. If I disconnect and open the settings, you can see the configuration options, quote type, trade type, and so on. You can also see the list of symbols I'm using. For example, I'm collecting Eris D ticks and candles to demonstrate how the charting works. Additionally, I'm collecting M15 candles for the phantom drift strategy, which uses indicators. In the mapping window, you can create symbol mappings, useful when your broker uses a different symbol name than ours for the same instrument or index. You can also find the index's table and session settings here. Let's reconnect my account and move on to the strategy section. I've already added Phantom Drift, which is currently the best masked arbitrage strategy available. It uses a type of averaging technique making the broker believe that the trader is using a grid or martingale strategy, while in reality, it's an arbitrage system disguised under that structure. We are also developing another auxiliary strategy designed to create even more noise, adding non-arbitrage trades to further conceal the behavior of Phantom Drift and other arbitrage systems. If you click on the Strategies button, you'll see the list of built-in strategies, you can see one-leg arbitrage and lock arbitrage strategies designed for different types of brokers and trading conditions. These strategies allow you to lock trades either on one or two accounts using different algorithms. We can help you choose which strategy best fits your setup. Or you can use the strategy selector available on our website. It will automatically suggest the most suitable strategy for your specific case. The hedge strategy is popular not only in Forex trading, but also in crypto arbitrage. Statistical arbitrage belongs to what I would call non-toxic, non-latency strategies. The triangular arbitrage and L-pouring strategies can help you transfer funds from a broker who resists withdrawals to a more reliable one. Next, you can see Bright Trio and Bright Duo well-masked arbitrage strategies designed for trading across three and two accounts, respectively. Multi-hedge and custom bot allow you to build your own strategy inside SharpTrader using the coding module, which I'll explain later. TrendPulse is a trend-following non-arbitrage strategy, while pair trading is also non-arbitrage. It's based on the divergence of correlated instruments, such as a futures contract and its spot equivalent on oil. And finally, the Phantom Drift strategy, the most sophisticated and well-camouflaged arbitrage strategy we have. I'll leave a link to a detailed video about it in the description. When adding a strategy, simply select it and click OK. 
the program will suggest choosing a template from the list. I select one, and the main strategy setup window opens. Here, you can choose whether the strategy should operate on one or two brokers, select the fast feed, and adjust the general parameters. Then, under the Instruments and Orders tab, you'll find preset configurations from the selected template for the most common arbitrage symbols. Next, the Orders tab displays all open orders. You can filter them by session or by strategy. The Performance tab helps you analyze the performance of any strategy. For example, let's open Phantom Drift and view results for all time. Here, you'll see Profit and Loss PNL, as well as Execution Statistics, Slippage on Opening and Closing, Execution Times, and more. This helps identify how well the strategy performs and whether the broker is using any anti-arbitrage mechanisms. You'll also see a pie chart showing order distribution by instrument and a summary panel indicating the first trade date, profit, losses, total orders, etc. In this example, there aren't many trades, so the statistics aren't very illustrative. This is just to demonstrate how the analytics module works. The analysis module allows you to compare tick data and determine which broker is faster. For instance, I can compare ticks from our New York feed with my CTrader account. After selecting Eurodollar and launching real-time tick analysis, a new window opens showing tick updates from both feeds. Since I'm recording this video between sessions, the market is quiet. But under normal conditions, this feature clearly displays latency differences between feeds extremely useful for arbitrage setup tuning. The backtest option is not yet available, but will be implemented soon. The charting module is for manual trading. You can open a new chart, for example, M15, and attach indicators from the built-in list. Here, I've added an oscillator, and it appears on the chart. You can analyze price behavior, or even place manual trades directly from this window. The coding module allows you to create your own bots. You can click Add Bot, Name It, and Start Coding. The Filters section lets you create filters that can be integrated into strategies to exclude unwanted market conditions. We've also added a built-in AI assistant that can help you code filters even if you have no programming skills. Just click Add Filter, Name It, for example, RSI2, and press OK. 
Then, open the AI Assistant and type a prompt such as code filter based on RSI indicator levels. The AI Coding Assistant will generate the filter code for you. If there's a compilation error, it will automatically analyze it and produce a corrected version of your filter. Next is AI Optimization, a tool for optimizing your strategy parameters. After the strategy has traded for a while, the AI Assistant analyzes trade results, slippage data, and execution times across different configurations, and then suggests the best set of parameters. In short, you can use AI to automatically fine-tune your arbitrage strategy settings. The Journal tab displays logs of your system activity, The News Filter allows you to control trading during economic events. You can upload a news calendar and specify whether to avoid or trade during certain news releases. For example, to skip trades when there's high-impact news on specific currencies. The Database tab is for data management. Under Settings, you can select Interface Languages. Telegram Alerts allows you to connect a Telegram bot and receive notifications about your trades, for example, when an order is opened or an error occurs, so you can react instantly. Under Interface, you can switch from a single window layout to a multi-window one, and you can also switch to a light theme if you prefer a brighter interface. Thank you for watching. At this point, Sharp Trader is the most advanced arbitrage trading platform available. I encourage you to learn more about it, watch additional videos, and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. We provide lifetime free support for all our programs. Let's work together. Thank you for your attention, and don't forget to like this video.